Today we have a special guest, Manita Kelson Mook at the Art and Public Spaces, Polksoyberget, Berlin Mitte. In the background we have a, um, a special exhibition by uh, Israeli artist Yael Sternberg that we finally put up in spite of all the uh, wars and atrocities and we're very happy about it. And about you, Manita. Uh, how long have you been in Berlin and uh, what has been your recent exhibition and uh, what are your exhibition plans for the future? Okay, so I, I, I would like to hello to everyone. Yeah, um, my name is Manita. I'm originally from Bangkok and I am a visual artist based in Berlin. So um, I have been in Berlin since last year because uh, I want to uh, pursue my career as an artist. So I'm relocated from Thailand to live here. So now, so far, almost two years I have been here, like work as an artist, and also I am a teach art instructor and a teacher as well in the same time. So um, to talk about my um, current project, as of now, I'm working on my project. Its topic is about uh, gender symbolism, like of fruit and human body so like actually i want to like investigate my mm -hmm. about how people perceive intricate about fruit because as we know fruit is just like a um can reflect and associate with gender symbolism like a social construction as a gender and also um physical of fruit can mm -hmm. defy the gender, like can defy femininity, masculine. But for my work, I'm focused on um, female traits of fruit, like brown, sweet meat, seed, red meat, all kind of that thing. So I'm um, trying to do like, um, now I'm doing the research about um, meaning and what people interpret fruit in universal meaning and locally because uh, fruit have the same meaning as uh, our shared humanity. Well, Indeed. Uh, Manita was a special guest uh, last week on Friday for our workshop for all and it was a very inspiring uh, workshop. Uh, a lot of uh, crowds came up, which is so important because everyone knows how important uh, attendees and the numbers of attendees are the number of uh, the public uh, are for the public institutions so uh, it was a total success and i love the way uh, you stressed the gender constructions and the relation to the fruit and that everybody had this uh, freedom uh, to associate to, with the fruit and they associate special colors to the fruit that uh, everyone drew and uh, we will uh, finally exhibit all the uh, workshop results um, in our spaces uh, returning to your work, I, I like this uh, mm, desire yeah. Yeah. Uh, and the gender and the specific uh, underlying of the uh, femininity in your work. Mm -hmm. uh, who, which artist or, or mainly, who has been your artistic inspiration? Um, actually, I, I, I don't have like a specific one, like a um, favorite artist, but I'm interested in like symbolism and surrealist idea for my art and actually um, if back to my background because of my my dad is also artist and so like I grew up in artist family so since I remember I start like I like drawing since I remember so I would say um, the important influence is my family to start to do art and when I grew up I specific like on the topic about human being and also I like to highlight the female body as a key object that I can reflect the uh, human human being like uh, how humanity is and also um, yeah so my my area that I'm interested in so it's about uh, figurative and uh, I used to like symbolism and the surrealistic idea in my work. Yeah, I, I could say, so actually I like um, many artists who in the area that like
like a work on symbol symbolism and uh, stere stereolithic. Mm. Um, what uh, what uh, could be uh, important for you uh, 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 when working in Berlin? So you moved uh, from uh, Bangkok to Berlin. Uh, what is so special about uh, mm -hmm. Berlin, uh, being a Berlin artist? Yeah, be because uh, I, I at, at the beginning, I want to um, pursue the, my career as an artist somewhere. So um, I'm trying to travel to Berlin before like few times. And I feel um, like to make sure that I, I want to live here or not, I want to work out here or not. And so, and then I decide to move here and I think that it's very important I mean surrounding it's very important to shape my perspective and my and my idea I can feel like before and after I move here um, international art scene and like the people here because here is very open open from diverse culture and like, like we have uh, artistic freedom a lot in Berlin so I think this thing is like a very influence my perspective to perceive the world. That means like this thing also reflect that how I develop my work as well, and also connection. Like uh, I get to know uh, many people from uh, from diverse background, like uh, many national diverse nationality. So it's very important for 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 the link that I can perceive the world also um, develop my work as well. Oh, it's very good that you think mm -hmm. uh, Berlin still, he, uh, still has this yeah. uh, diversity in it and this I international art scene, uh, which is really inspiring. Uh, but um, do you think your art is political? Yeah, I think art and political is like the same thing that contribute each other. But my art is not like political directly, but just like indirect because I'm interested in like social and cultural issue, and this thing is also um, like a relate to political in somehow. Like yes, but I some um, because my topic is always come from surrounding in term of um, cultural or social issue. I have some project that like relate to. Um, cultural issue in Thailand, mm -hmm. and but it's also in direct way to reflect our political in Thailand as well. So I I can say um, usually art that always relate and always um, affect to political and also politics always in, in the same way always affect to art as well. And other artists. That's why I idea that too that. Uh, Every art, even art mm -hmm. that is not directly political, yeah. has deep political implications. Mm -hmm. uh, and uh, how do you think? Uh, how do you think? Um, uh, historically, uh, if there is any transformative movement forward uh, in sense of being a woman artist in Berlin, uh, how do you feel? Uh, what has to be still done <laughs> to promote more women in art? <laughs> yeah, actually, personally, for me, I, I think art is a made, made like for female and male equal. Make art, art make everyone like equal, make everyone the same. Because, and also, for me, um, pers uh, per my perception about female artists, I think that as a female, it's not a weakness mm -hmm. that to be artist. Is in somehow we female have some perspective that different from from male. Yeah, yeah. we just need to yeah. show more women artists. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're not shown uh, enough. <laughs> yeah. So I, I think that to be a female artist is like um, it's not a weakness, but it's not struggle. But we can have some point that like special and mm -hmm. um, different, like a uh, another aspect from from the other land. How is it in Thailand? Is it also so difficult for women to exhibit and find galleries and make a career as artists? Yes, and in Thailand it's more difficult than here because uh, in Thai in market in Thailand it's not like a uh, open and not big like here, and the movement is not active that much. Even like uh, in any gender, it's also like not not like we don't have good opportunity as Berlin. Yeah, but like, and also I think the perception
attraction of people in Thailand for, for me like because my work I like to do like female body something mm-hmm. sexuality and fit and naked body is like um, it fit in my work but because I think the naked body is a, just like a beauty because I'm perceived as an art and also in Thailand it's difficult to um to discuss about sexuality it's not a topic that we can discuss openly it's different from here so um, even if portray in art form it's still not um, easy to to accept that that much but different from here because here like uh, it's more free it's more it's free, more free. Uh, and accept mm-hmm. any kind of expression in in the form of art Yes, uh, that's at least uh, one step forward, uh, and uh, I think it will get even better. We we really have uh, and to struggle uh, about more women in, in art, and it will pay for women artists, uh, which is still to be done. Uh, and uh, yes, there is much to to achieve still. Uh, what is for you uh, the role of art? This. Uh, for some people, uh, it is that art has a special mission. How would you define it, if at all? Mm, um, the role of art in contemporary okay. society. Mm, actually, I think for every artist, art just um, basically art is a tool that they um, express the thought, perception. I mean, in individual thoughts and perception things, but we can do more than that. Like uh, art can can like make us to connect with the other i mean for me personally i art is a thing that connect me with surrounding um, for example connect me with the relationship with the people connect me with the society so i for me i use art as the tool that connect me with with the other thing with society with our culture with the something that surrounding me yes mm. I think it's a art, it's a role of art for my opinion and maybe more than that can make a movement 